All right, guys, welcome back. This is part five. We're going to do a couple hunts before I get back to the story. And we're going to take advantage of this times two multiplier. So, as far as licensing goes and equipment and whatnot, just super quick, Knight, Monk, Black Mage, Ulan, I leveled him up a little bit, I gave him Fulminating Darkness, I can't remember if I did this part on screen, I think I did actually now that I'm looking at it, um, I leveled up Vaughn a little bit more, uh, he picked up a Shield Block, and another Swords 3, which is kind of meh. But I think I'm going to try to go this way to get adrenaline at the very least. And then we kind of start getting into what appears to be some of the battle lore upgrades. Speaking of which, I gave Balthier the other three, I believe, I had all lined up here. And there's another one there when he gets up to 30, so... Fran picked up Feral Strike, so I'll be trying to up her HP a little bit there. I think I had the rest of this stuff. She's had a couple magic lures, so that's always nice. And I gave her this um, armlet thingy just because there's no point in having nobody with anything. And Bosch has the battle harness. He still has his Mithril Blade for now. I gave her the head guard I picked up just because she could use the extra magic resist. And then, yeah, she gets one and one of defense, magic, resist, and a little bit of HP. Because he's obviously getting some magic resist there, so. That is my current setup for all intents and purposes. I've got both theory to steal from enemies. Apparently, I don't have... Usually, what I do is um, foe... Well, what would it be? I guess faux HP equals 100% is usually what I put to steal. sure where this guy is. You know, he's probably in the middle part here. Hmm, nothing, eh? not what I wanted to do, but I'll work with it. I find it interesting all the elements have different MP values. Oh, wow, you are really screwing us over here, Balthier. I'm just going to get you right out of there, then. Jeez, what does this guy have absolute evasion on? This is ridiculous. There we go. Hmm. 
So as I said, if they're going to offer me times 2 multiplier, I feel like times 4 might be a little too fast, but I also might try that later on. I'm going to leave everything else I could be doing right now. I'll talk to him. But that's about as far as that goes. Oopsies. I have to figure out how to actually like properly select your leader. I tried stealing from the T-Rex guy here, but I was unsuccessful, and then quite obviously I had to run right afterwards, so... So a major part of why Fran and Bosch are in the party right now is because one, I kind of want to get used to Fran's magic and two, and more importantly, hmm, okay. sorry, are you the moveling guy? You are the moveling guy. Uh, they both have quickenings, and I think I'm actually going to try the... I think it's the Cluckatrice, not the... Or no, it'd be the Chickatrice. I'm not even sure. The one in Giza Plains. I'm not entirely sure what I'm talking about anymore. getting these super early in the game. I'm glad I came to look. These are completely new. Well, I don't know what the hell I'm going to do about these, but I am going to grab them now.
I don't think I care for any of these. Okay, well, yeah, I'm kind of glad I came in here. Uh, Fran doesn't have enough variety of magic to really make those useful, but I'll try to see what I can do. She also needs a few more uh, gambits. But now that I know that she can actually make some use of them, I will probably pick those up. That is amazing that those are here so early. Usually it's like... I don't even think you get them in Balfenheim. I think you get them, like, basically on your way to Pharos. Like, the second time you go through Balfenheim. I feel like everybody knows it's Vaughn's fault. And they're all just too nice to say anything. when he gets five hits in, the guy's disappearing for three of them. <laughs> Nothing to her. I feel like gauntlets would be a good accessory for Vaughn. I'm just going to head through the low town to get to the south exit. I've got a bit of a training spot, if you will, um, in the Osman Plain where I usually chain 50 of those werewolf looking guys. I don't think they're actually called werewolves there. I think that's what they call them actually here in the Giza. But irregardless. Where was I even going with that statement? Oh, that's usually where I do a little bit of LP training and a little bit of... Oh, come on, friend. Yeah. Uh, I usually try to get my 50 chain there, which this time will apparently lead to a trophy, so. Which will be made a hell of a lot faster given I can now, you know, double time it. No. 
so the Gluckatrace is the target. But the Chickatrace are there as well, so. I'm gonna get a solid save in here. It's slightly unfortunate that I can't get another Mist Quickening, preferably for Balthier, but I do believe he's too far away. Well, I guess he's not that far away. Where's his other ones? Oh, well, there's one right there too. Yeah, it would take me quite a while to get his red spiral, so... He's sitting right next to one, though, 50. Ugh, I don't feel like killing 50 of these guys anyways, but... That should make the next battle a little more manageable. Okay, so, funny news about going after that hunt, and the reason why I just kind of edited that part out is because I am nowhere near strong enough to be able to do that. It's not so much the physical strength, it's the fact that there's four of them, which is a little troublesome, and um, I have nothing to cure stone with right now. So, that is the unfortunate reality of that is the guy did a stone gaze, he hit all three of my party members, and it was just a countdown to, well, to get out of there. I didn't actually die, but I ran away. And as long as he can keep doing that, I'll have to keep running away, so even if I kill off two of his little guys first... So we are going to head to the west gate and go and talk to Balthier. Yeah, it's a little upsetting, but like I said, until I can get some of those... Um, I don't even know what they are. I think they're called gold needles.
This is the Strahd. Airship in our for you. <laughs> the strong. You really are a sky pirate. Well, the headhunters seem to think so. What's a good word? Is she ready? So is she armed? How fast is she? Could she take the free? I suppose I could tell you, but. Would you rather see for yourself? Hmm? Yeah. Brian, our course. The shortest way is over Dorstonis. Our flies, Bushamba. Oh, she's free as can be. Now. The Empire took notice when they announced the princess's unfortunate suicide in your entire execution. If it becomes known that I'm alive, the Marcus will lose their faith. They try to steer clear of such things. Right, it's time to fly. And no wagging tongues or you'll like to bite them off. I'm coming. to our feeding, yes? I have my brother. She eats well. See that she does. We need her alive. Balthier's bait must be fresh. I keep trying to tell you. I barely even know who Balthier is. My brother! A message come from Ravanaster. The Strahl she sets sail. She makes straight for the sky city of Bajerba. Barely know, was it? Yet I'll trace he goes bounding off for you. Tell me, how could that be? I... That's what I'd like to know. I just met him that one time and that's Does it. Does that tongue never stop? What if we plucked it from your head? As for you, we need Balthier alive. His corpse fetches but half the bounty. A tender beaten, my specialty. There's no fun for it if we can't tease out a scream or two. Where are you? Easy. No good, he's not here. Keep searching. This way. You're a dead man. Don't forget it. And no names. Of course.
The Lusu mines are just up ahead. Oh, I do hear there's not much left there these days. You're on your way to the mines? Then please allow me to accompany you. I have an errand to attend to there. What manner of errand? What errand? I might ask the same of you. Right. Come on then. What? Excellent. Do me a favor and stay where I can keep my eye on you. Should be less trouble that way. For us both. So what's your name? Oh, I, uh, I'm, I'm Lamont. Don't worry. I don't know what's in that mine, Lamont, but you're in good hands. Right, Bosch? What was the one thing he said right before you left the Sky Dome? No names. What's the first thing Vaughn does? Not even introduce himself. Or Balthier, you know. Goes straight for Bosch, the one guy that's like... Pretty well known in this area, I assume. Even though he's supposed to be dead. For anything that's only gonna up my stats a couple anyways, so I'll deal with the rest of that later. I doubt I'm gonna buy anything in here, but I might see if I can at least upgrade her bow. Actually, no, I won't be able to. Come to think of it. Apparently he could have been using that, but wasn't. That's okay. Yeah, let's see what this guy's doing. Oh, wow. That ain't half bad, actually. I guess they've had to adjust all of the uh, extra characters or guest characters, as they like to be called.
Again, all that stuff falls in the category of I can't actually use it now, but I still don't really care. Thankfully, I've already purchased most of my gambits that I need right now, so I'll just stick with this. Lusu Mines, one of the richest veins in Ivalice. Under Imperial Guard, no doubt. Actually, no. With but few exceptions, the Imperial Army is not permitted within Bujerba. Well, shall we proceed? So I think I did this kind of when I was going to fight the uh, Cluckatrice, so you guys wouldn't have seen it, but because he's got an earth weapon, I put um, his attack to earth vulnerable so he won't start healing people like he did last time. I've also got him to faux HP 100% steal, so I can try to steal some items, pick up some trophies that way, and I gave him Libra, so he can just use that on his own. I gave her Fire Week, Lightning Week, Ice Week. If nothing else, she can attack. I'm going to put this back. I put it to potion because I just needed faster healing. And actually most of these guys are just these two anyways. Forgive me for asking, but you are diverting the purest of the Magicite. I can assure you it reaches Lord Vane most discreetly. Ha! <laughs> you wear your saddle well. Be that as it may, I have no intention of being bridled, Your Honor. Then you prefer the whip? Stubbornness will see not only you broken, Excellency, but Bougerba as well. Ondor the Fourth, the Marquis of Bougerba. 
The Marquis served as mediator at the negotiations of Damascus' surrender. It would appear that he is somewhat less neutral now. They say he's been helping the Resistance. They say many things. You're certainly well informed. Who did you say you were again? What difference does it make? We have to find Penelo. And Penelo is your... She's a friend. She was kidnapped and taken here. Yay, some actual fighting. So I am going to try to kill everything I possibly can here, seeing as how we do have Lamont. Oh yeah, one other thing. I'm currently down all of my arrow motes. I had this foolproof plan that I would get all the chickatrices close to the cluckatrice, and then I would unlock the oh, sorry, unleash a couple arrow motes. Which sounded great until I found out that apparently they absorb wind. Which was fantastic, and then I tried a warp mode, and it didn't work, so... Oh, okay. Apparently they're not going to let me open this. amazing how much that fourth character actually makes a difference.
Well, that might work a little better against those uh, chicka traces. I pretty much knew as soon as these bats showed up that uh, my party was taking a hit, so... It's pretty awesome, I just picked up the technique. I'm kinda glad I came back. on the plus side, at least I got a trophy this video. I think these bone fragments are actually pretty valuable, so... Entirely sure what that trophy was for. They don't actually have the Sky Pirates done anymore. Well, I'll look that up another time. Huh. 
As much fun as it would be, I'm definitely not strong enough to be fighting, uh, what's his face? And his band of cronies, so. And just so you guys aren't surprised when I turn and tuck tail and run. And you know what, too? I was trying to figure out what was missing from that menu, and I'm kind of upset with myself that it just dawned on me. After I get two things that are in the Sky Pirates den, it's not there. Unless I get it later, who knows. This is what I came here to see. What's that? It's Nethesite. Manufactured Nethesite. Nethesite? Unlike regular Magicite, Nethesite absorbs magical energy. This is the fruit of research into the manufacture of Nethesite. All at the hands of the Draclaw Laboratory. So this is where they're getting the Magicite. Errand all attended to, then? Thank you. I'll repay you shortly. No, you'll repay us now. We have too much on our hands to go on holding yours. So, where did you hear this fairy tale about Nethesite? And where did you get that sample you carry? What do you know about the Draglaw Laboratories? Tell me, who are you? Balthier? You kept us waiting, Balthier! You slipped away in Nalbana! We missed you! First to judge and know this boy! The whole affair has a smell of money about it! I may have to wet my beak a little! Keep your snout in the trough where it belongs. This thinking ill befits you, Bagamnon. Balthier! <laughs> Too long have I gone unpaid! I'll carve my bounty out of that boy! Where's Pinello? We're taking her back! The girl? Why keep the bait when you've landed the fish? We cut her loose on the way here and then off she ran crying like a babe! <sighs> hey! <sighs> After them! <sighs> Hey, wait up! We'll not be able to take them all. Fight who we must, leave the rest. Make this a little more entertaining. Uh oh. Wow, one of them is clearly faster than the others. Someone's taking a hit. Oh no, she moved. It would not seem they follow. We've lost them. Much more running about with Bunga at my heels, and I'm apt to give up sky pirating altogether. Oh, my God. 
Putting these bat fangs and uh, bone fragments actually amount to some decent kill. I see you've been out walking without the company of your cortege, Lord Lhasa. We caught her wandering out of the mines. You must take care with such undesirables about. I was kidnapped Silence! And... If it is a crime to wander on one's own, then I too am guilty. Marquis. I trust that your estate can accommodate another guest. Why not? Judge Geese, I shall heed your counsel. I will not travel unaccompanied any longer. That was unexpected. Thank you, Penelo. Uh, of course. What's Penelo doing? And what's the deal with that Lamont? That's no Lamont. Lhasa Ferinas Solidor, fourth son to Emperor Gramis, and brother to Vane. What? That kid? Do not worry. I believe he will treat her well. Nobody knows men like Fran does. Our purposes lead the same way, to Ondor. We must find means to approach him. The Marquis is channeling money to organizations opposing the Empire. We'll start there. Marquis Andor announced my execution two years ago. If news of my survival were to spread, the Marquis may find his position compromised. The men he's been funding bear little love for the Empire. They won't be thrilled to discover that rumors of your death were, in fact, greatly exaggerated. If we were to raise a clamor to that effect, we might just get their attention. Nothing to it. I'll just go around town spreading the word. How about this? I'm Captain Bosch von Rotzenberg of Dalmaska. Well, what do you think? That certainly qualifies as a clamor. All right, Vaughn, get to it. For the girl's sake, eh? Oh, and the more people around to witness your little performance, the better. If we're going to reach the Marquis, it's up to you. We'll be waiting here if you need us. So I'm actually hoping that I can get to the save point, and I can, good. I'm actually going to save it here. Like I said, I did cut out that one fight, but I'm not entirely sure how long I was there for, so... I don't want to run this video too long, on the off chance I wasn't there for all that long to begin with. I wasn't exactly planning on running away, so I didn't really take a start time. 
So when I see you guys in part six, we'll finish up here. And where do we end up? I think we end up on the Le Leviathan, actually, so that'll be fun. I'll see you guys in part six.